Hi everybody and welcome to Cavaliers Corner. Mick Morano and head coach, first year head coach of the Walsh University Lady Cavaliers, Kate Bruce. Kate, thanks for stopping by and chit-chatting and kind of updating a little bit uh, uh, with what's going on so far. What's your impressions uh, of the job? Your first year as a head coach, you had uh, many years as a great player and then also as an assistant coach with uh, some solid programs in Youngstown State and Ohio University. Now you're a first year head coach. What do you think so far? Um, just trying to get used to it so far. It's definitely different from being a player, being an assistant, so just kind of working through some things here and I'm enjoying it. Uh, we're a little bit over halfway. You've got the team positioned in, uh, in a good spot, a pretty tough schedule uh, remaining, but if you get on a little bit of a run, you'll get into the playoffs. Yeah, I mean, the GLIAC, we've talked about it before, the GLIAC's a great conference. Um, now we're going to play all these teams in the South, so now it's really going to be important for us to take every game serious and preparation serious and do the best that we can. Kate, as you look at it as a head coach, uh, as opposed to being an assistant, you almost have to be kind of like, I guess, the, would be a psychologist <laughs> to deal with all of the personalities on the team to get everybody on the same page. And probably that's more of a challenge than maybe the X's and O's on the, on the floor. Right, exactly. I mean, when you're dealing with 15 different personalities, you can't coach all the players the same way that you would – you can't coach them all the same way, but luckily I have a uh, psychology major <laughs> or a bachelor's degree, so I'm, I'm trying the best I can. <laughs> you know, and you can rely on your assistant coaches. They do a terrific job for you. Yes, they've been fantastic, even with the whole transition thing um, and taking over at a random time like September, right when the season was starting, and they've been very great to have around. They're all very good people, which has been nice, so... Um, Jessica and Sierra just do a heck of a job, and they're, they're people that you've counted on throughout the course of the year to get you to this point during the season. Yes, definitely, and they do um, a lot of our recruiting too, so they're doing things outside that people probably don't even realize what they're doing, but they're taking late-night trips to watch high school games too, so they do a lot for this program. Okay, when you take a look at it uh, up to this point in the season, is there a part of the team that uh, you're not happy with uh, that you thought would have been a little bit better? And then is there an area of the squad, the way that they're playing, that uh, surprisingly has they've done well where you thought that they wouldn't have done uh, that good and would struggle? Yeah, I think we've just, in general, had a lot. We've had a lot of highs and lows, and right now we're just kind of trying to figure out how to be consistent the whole game like we'll we'll have a good couple minutes or a good quarter and we have to find a way to put that all together so and that's my job to make sure that 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 happens so now that you mentioned that uh, just a couple of games ago you had I believe seven points in the second quarter and was it seven in the fourth or something right like that. and then like 23 and, then, yeah. and 20 so, so it's like I said it's just yep yeah, it's just still getting comfortable with the system and and it's just we need to be more consistent as you approach then down the stretch here, is there going to be a key to uh, the shooting seems to have come around a little bit. Is there going to be a, yeah. a key? <laughs> a little bit, I said. Yeah, Just a, a little, little bit. bit. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, is there going to be a key to it uh, down the stretch here to get into the playoffs? Yeah, I mean, it's important to make shots. I mean, you that's important in the game of basketball. You have to put the ball through the hoop to get the points. And I think um, we've been taking it a little more serious. Girls have been coming outside of practice time to get shots up, which says a lot about them that they're willing to work on it. So we're going to have to make shots and we're going to have to play defense. And if we can do those two things, I think we'll be pretty successful here down the stretch. And you're still working a little bit with your rotation. Uh, uh, plugging certain girls in in certain spots, and I guess right. that's an ongoing thing. Yep, yep, still trying to find the right pieces to, to play out a full game instead of just one quarter or two quarters. So. Well, Kate, best of luck to you. We'll be with Thank you the you. rest of the way, and thanks for stopping by and chatting with us. And uh, well, We know you, you've done a fantastic job up to this point, and we'll continue uh, to, to grow uh, as uh, we move through the rest of the season. Thank you very much. Kate Bruce, head coach of the Walsh University Cavaliers on Cavaliers Corner.